Hello everyone and welcome to the first video in this Next.js video series or video course. So you must be asking why the heck should I learn Next.js now, right? So there are multiple reasons. So first of all, it is the most popular React framework. So if you go to React documentation, they will tell you that it is advised moving forward to use Next.js as a primary uh, framework. The other thing is that you can build full stack applications with it. So imagine just if you learn one technology or one framework, you will be able to become a full stack developer. Without leaving a folder of your repo, you will create both server and client side. That's just amazing. And you can do this because it's packed with features. So for example, a router. So what it means is if you're using React, you need to create or actually to install other libraries in order to use the routing. In Next.js, this is all being built in. This is just one feature, but there are plenty of them. Now, what you will learn in this course. So there are a number of things. So first of all, you will learn routing, as I said, server components, data fetching, server actions, working with databases, authentications, deployments, and much, much more. But what is the most exciting thing is that you're gonna learn all these features by doing, and it's not gonna be just some boring theory stuff, but actually we're gonna start off by building some simple applications where we're gonna get a grasp of Next.js and then move towards more complex applications and learn more advanced features of Next.js. And by the end of this course, you will have an extensive Next.js knowledge and you can call yourself a full stack developer and apply for all of these positions that have been marketed as a full stack. This is amazing. So if this sounds exciting for you, let's jump in. Well, that's all for this video. And thanks for stopping by. And don't forget to subscribe. Code with Sloba. Thank you for watching the entire video. To see more videos like this, click here.